Hi, Dave Lopez here and Chase Lopez. We're reaching out to our ILG family to talk about the current market volatility because it has been crazy, hasn't it? Boy, I don't think we've seen this much volatility in probably over 13 years. And that's not only the stock market, but also we're seeing it in the bond market as well. Yeah, part of our job as your advisory team is to reach out to you specifically in unusual times or times like these with uh, more turbulence. And boy, it has been turbulent over the last three or four months. Let me give you a couple numbers. Chase, I'm gonna need my glasses for this. <laughs> as of year to date, as of this recording, we're April 22nd today, yes. mm -hmm. S&P down almost 9%, about 8.8%. The Dow, which is it's large US stocks, down over 5.5%. The NASDAQ, Tech, yep, right? Technology companies. Down about 16 and a quarter percent. And even Europe, their stocks, the uh, Euro stock X50, which think of that like the Dow for, for Europe, 11%. And what were you saying about bonds? Yeah, it, uh, this has probably been one of the uh, more worst quarters we've seen with bonds. I think they're down about 9.5% year to date. Yeah, and that's crazy when you've been thinking that bonds were your safe haven to protect you. Right. right? But that's something we've been talking about now for two years with that when interest rates went up, that you would see bonds actually losing money on paper. Regardless, today what we want to talk to you about is what to do about this turbulence, specifically with your accounts. Now, I want to remind you, we're trying to get this message out to everybody in the ILG family. So today, this is not about individual advice for your accounts. In general, though, we just want to remind you that the money that we've positioned by building out your comprehensive plan, the money we've positioned in the market is for long-term growth. And that is based on the characteristics of the market. Yeah, absolutely. So whenever we have built out your plan, uh, these type of environments, we plan for them, right? So to Dave's point, the money that we have in the market, that's gonna be for, lo for long term. So the idea here is we stick with the plan, stick with what we've built out, and uh, continue to kind of weather these, these storms. Yeah, we've always known that the market works like the tides, doesn't it? It comes in high tide, things are going good and everything's going up. Mm -hmm. And then there are periods of low tide where things recede and, and the market's going backwards. Well, we've had five, six plus years of high tide and it's right. easy to forget, isn't it Chase, mm -hmm. that there are times when the market contracts. This is one of those times and we have built it into your plan. Yeah. So our message today don't panic. We want to stick to our plan, which is the money in the market is a long-term hold. Now, if something has changed for you individually, where your money in the market is no longer a long-term hold based on how you're going to use your mar the, uh, the money, mm -hmm. right? Or for whatever reason, you feel like your risk tolerance has changed. Give us a call. Let's get together and go over your individual situation. Or if you have any questions, get with us. That's what we're here for, right? Yep. But we want to assure you that we are looking at this stuff daily uh, and working for you. Our job is to come to you with these types of events. I want to remind any of you that are in our risk mitigation strategies, and you might know them as the beta shield strategies. Those are strategies that are actually designed in times of turmoil to move you systematically to safer positions, to limit the downside. They are working as they've been designed to work. Some of the strategies already have 25% of your assets in safety, others as much as 50% in mm -hmm. safety. So the uh, takeaway from that is if you chose that strategy to limit the downside, it's working as designed. Now it doesn't avoid all risk, but it's designed to avoid a catastrophic loss and it's working as it's designed. Our advice is, unless your goals have changed or your timeline has changed, let the strategy do its thing. Right? Yeah, and if you haven't, uh, if maybe you don't recall exactly uh, what your strategy was, or you just want a refresher on your plan specifically, we strongly encourage you to call the office uh, and get on either Dave or I's calendar just to walk through it one more time. Yeah, or if you just want to get on the phone with Chase and I, or come in for a meeting to look at the plan again to get some reassurance that even in down markets, mm -hmm. Uh, the strategies you have are still the right strategies. That's what we're here for. So give us a call, give the office a call, Megan 
or Michelle will get you on the schedule and we can talk about your accounts. Until then, enjoy spring because it looks like we're finally getting warm weather.